Hey guys, welcome to another video, and today we'll be making elevator in Minecraft. So now, for this one, for this tutorial, you'll need um, a big area. And also what else you'll need is a, a set of a few pistons, repeaters, redstone, stairs, and also blocks. And also a button, which I didn't pick block at the time of recording this. So now... You'll need to place the pistons four blocks apart, which I didn't actually do in this recording. I, I did actually realize that after. They need to be four blocks apart because then, like after, you can put the stairs in, and then they're gonna push, and then both pistons are gonna push the stairs inwards, which will then lift you up. So you see, I'm putting in the stairs, and they cannot be upside down, otherwise it will not work. So I'm just going to place in the stairs. Now the stairs doesn't matter. And also the blocks that like you're using to place redstone on. Now the timing, it matters a lot. Also you need a button. Now you can use another source, it's just that buttons are easier because they turn themselves on and they turn themselves off. So now I didn't actually get myself with enough space, I'm just going to break the fence. That was separating both elevators. The other one that is one that I, like, a rough drop earlier. So, now this is also another rough one, but it's, I guess, a better rough. So, here, I'm just going to put the button there. Now, where you put the button, like, doesn't directly matter. It's just that it's better to have it somewhere that it's easy to reach. So, I'm just going to put, I'm just going to make a tapper point, I call it. Which is just going to go, like, from... Let's like the button to the other side. This can be covered up, hence why I'm doing it two blocks down. But like you can also put it around back as well, but just for this one I'm putting it around the front. Now there I'm just gonna li link it back up. Just gonna put that into there. And also gonna put that signal into that into that piston. Which will which I'm just going to put the repeats in so that it doesn't act so the signal doesn't die. And now I'm just going to press a button and see how it works. Now you see, that's the first layer. Now this does take a while to make, this elevator. But it does work. Like, and... Let me just say that... I'm not going to say that I'm the only person who knows how to make an elevator. In Minecraft. Because I'm not. Many other people know how to make them and have made them in the past. And have made better ones. It's just that this is the way that I found works. So if you need a better one, like, go look at someone else. Like, I don't have any, like, uh, preferences to look at, but, like, just, uh, just, like, find a tutorial on YouTube and then, yeah. So now I'm just going to put the, um, repeater there. My watch is going up for some reason, but, yeah. But, yeah, I'm just going to link that back into there. Sorry about that. And... I'm now just going to test the second layer, which are both on the same timing. And for this, timing is key. So now I'm just going to put that into there. Now I'm just going to take a tap from there. Just link it back up to the piston, and then I'm going to put the repeaters in. I'm going to put one there, and also one there. So now, like, for the repeaters, there's no, like, perfect, um, like, uh, I don't know what the word is. But, like, it doesn't go up, like, per like in, like, perfect, as such. Like, the bottom one is one, and this one's two, yeah, that goes up well. But, like, a bit above, like, it doesn't, like, double, as such. Or, like, go up in, like, perfect, uh, number, uh, like, perfect increments. So, it's just that. It works this way. And there, signal I think is dying. I was going to use the, um, like, the trick where it, the signal goes up the block. But I didn't. Which I could have done. Also, I'm putting in this, um, backboard. Because, like, when you go to, like, use it, it'll actually push you off. But then that backboard's there so that it won't push you off. 
So now I'm just going to put an, a, another set of blocks here so I can put the redstone. So now for this elevator, like, it needs to be like perfect on both sides. Otherwise, like, one um, stair will go and then the other one won't. So I'm just going to tap into th that signal. This is mapping it out like at the time of recording because this was voiceover after. I'm just going to put some set of repeaters there and as I said earlier, it doesn't go up in a perfect increment. There it goes up in one, but like after it won't, to my knowledge. And yeah. And yeah, see that works. And now I need to tap into the now I need to tap the fourth one. Now I'm just gonna put it onto that side of the redstone. This is a personal preference. Break the bottom block and put it into there. Now I'm just gonna put that on a max. Also, like I prefer putting them all on max. Like for me, like what I found is that like it doesn't work on anything like below three ticks on the piston. Or not piston on the repeater. So now I'm just gonna put the repeater there. Just make sure it's the same on both sides, otherwise I said earlier one will go and the other one won't. Which and there I don't think I should put the same amount. Well, I'll be able to change that after. Also, this one only goes up a five, but like, if you need to make it go any higher, I'm just gonna change the day or the time. And just saying, this is done on console, but yeah, as I was saying, both need to be like the same timing, otherwise, yeah. So now I'm just going to link that into there. Now that's gridding, which I don't usually like. I'm just going to try to change that, but it didn't. It doesn't work. Now I don't usually like it gridding like how it did, but it's fine at times depending on the situation. So now I'm just going to go and test that it's all working. Now that fourth one isn't going because it was not connected. Which is one thing that you have to always make sure with doing redstone is that it's connected and that signal's not dying. That's a tip for uh, new redstoners. And yeah, that's the fourth one going. Not not in perfect time. Which at the time of recording I found at the time of recording I thought it was going too um what's the word early. But in actuality I was going too late. So there, I'm using the trick where it goes up the block. It powers the block, and then it powers the redstone. And then, I don't know why I flew over, but I'm pretty sure that wasn't working again. But yeah. What I wasn't realizing was that it was already going too late. And I tried to make it even later to solve the issue, which is not going to solve it. So I'm just going to take out that because it's pointless. And I'm going to try putting another repeater in here, like in recording, but I don't know like, why I thought that solved the issue. And, uh, like I'm using different increments for the repeater. And then I realized it's not like that that's the issue. Like after this test, I found that to repeat like the timing like the way I was doing it wasn't the issue it's just that it was already going like a certain rate so now there I've realized that's still going too late so now I'm just going to change that back to redstone just gonna take out that because it's unnecessary I'm just gonna put that there and then take out those now that's going too late, or is it okay? That's still going too late, so I'm just gonna go back and change one of the repeaters to a bit of redstone. Make sure it's linked. And yeah. So now, there, as you can see, the timing is okay. It'll work. 
Now this one, now this um, elevator is only going five blocks, so if you need it any higher, just like do, just change it and use trial and error for the timing. So yeah, just gonna put that onto the side. I'm just gonna take out the bottom block because like that's not gonna be used. Now this now this elevator is not the best on your resources if you're doing in survival. And like it's not like you know the nicest to make, like in survival as well. So I'm just going to like link it there. Now I'm just going to like put in the repeats on this side after I put these blocks in. Now, now I'm just going to put on that side and put the repeaters in. Make sure it's the same amount of repeaters. Now that's five on the top. Now I'm just going to put the red. That's going to lay down the redstone. And now that's going into there. Now that one's on the wrong side as personal personal preference. So I'm just going to link that into there. That's going to go up. It's going to go up into those repeaters. And I'm just going to go test this. And now, as you can see, that it drags you to the side, but that's what this one does. And like, it drags you to the side, and then you can just like walk to wherever. Um, then I'm just gonna make it a bit shorter. And yeah, just gonna make it a bit shorter so it's a bit, so it's a bit more compact. So I'm just gonna make it. Yeah, just gonna make the whole thing, and also do the same on the other side after. Now I'm contemplating if I should put the redstone on the inside of the corner, but then I realized it won't make that big of a difference. Now there I'm going to make it again more compact as I did with the other side. Now I'm just going to keep doing that. Now I'm just going to take out that. Now here I decided to put the red on the inside as well as going to do the other one. And so I'm also going to go back and change it on that side as well. So that's how you make an elevator. Just going to test it one more time, even though it should still work. Now one thing I'd like to say is that at times this one will lock up. And the repeatable power itself, even though there's no like main redstone signal and yeah that's one I made earlier like it's a rough one but it that one also works but yeah uh it's so yeah I hope this video helped in your world making an elevator it's just a bit nicer than making stairs now you could also make a um like water elevator which are easier and more compact but you know if you wanted like to use redstone in the world, then here's the elevator that you'd want. Now, as I said earlier, this isn't the most compact. This is not the best one. This is just one that works, and you can use it in your world. So, yeah. Also, that those two back blocks are necessary. So, it's been platinum. And I hope this helped, and I'll see you in the next video.